Hi guys, we have another spring summer style inspiration transitioning from winter to spring and of course summer. So you're going to see a mix of outfits in this video. Guys, don't forget to subscribe, like, share, comment, tell me which outfits are your favorites. So as you can see on your screen, we have three different outfits. They scream spring summer. This is what we call timeless pieces. Timeless pieces does not always mean or don't have to be white black beige or just some solid colors it's just things you can wear time and time and time again without them dating you or looking like old-fashioned all right so the very first one clearly it's good for spring especially towards the end of spring into summer it's a beautiful white dress it's flowy you can see how it moves right and it has these side openings and it's sleeveless i love how she has her hair i love everything about her outfit she looks glamorous right she looks sophisticated yet the dress is simple i know some of you don't think it's simple because it has these cutouts on the side but it's a simple white dress that makes you look elegant. You can wear this in the spring because we still have that chill in the air. There's still some bite in the air. You can put on a jacket and when it gets warm, you take off your jacket, right? You can even put on a warm scarf, something to just keep your shoulders warm. The only thing I don't like about this outfit, I feel like these shoes do age the outfit just a little bit right but nonetheless i love this outfit the second outfit yellow screams sunlight sunshine happiness it's that time of the year we're going to be outside white very classic um it's spring as well as it is a summer outfit once again if you are wearing them in spring and it's cold you can wear a jacket a trench coat and depending on how cold your state is you can even wear like some light boots right you can see how this can transition from a uh, spring to summer as well and then the very last outfit once again it springs it springs <laughs> it screams spring and summer to me spring why it's long sleeved right it keeps you warm from that you know chill in the air and the sandals of course they are springy as well as they're very much summer i love everything about this outfit and let me tell you if you're one of those girls who has like a smaller waist and some hips and something on your chest like some boobs this will look absolutely beautiful can we say boobs on youtube oh my god youtube don't get me some breasts this will look absolutely amazing on that body type it looks great on her but i'm saying if you have some more meat to your to your bones and some some coca-cola figure she looks amazing but i'm just saying you know i'm not saying she doesn't look good like please i have a question for you guys do you want me for the next following videos that i'm going to do to only have outfits for example like this image has the same outfit different angles so you see the 360 of the outfit but also in certain um outfits so you can see how the outfit moves compared to the first one we have three different outfits and you're only seeing it from one angle for example, this white dress, you don't see the front because I like the side because I wanted you to see the cutouts from the side. Clearly, you can see it moves, but someone else would, would be thinking, well, Mel, I, w I really wanted to see how it looks like from the front. So just let me know which you prefer, right? In, in such situations, then we would only have three to five outfits in each video. And the beauty of having the same outfits, different angles is you see how the outfit looks 360 degrees had i only taken this picture in the middle you wouldn't know what the back of this top looks like which is like bang it's open in the back it's sexy but you can also see why this is very much 
a spring outfit. There's some warmth offered uh, by this top, long sleeved, and I think this material looks like a warm material. And if it's very cold and she wants to keep her shoulders warm, she can wear a jacket. Better yet, she can wear like a very warm, large scarf on top. Just throw it around her shoulders and let it flow beautifully and that would make it look amazing i like how her jewelry is simple only earrings nothing on her neck which is exposing that beautiful the beautiful neck and shoulders right and the pants are simple wide leg black pants i don't know if these are jeans or black khakis but i love the trimming in the in the jeans to me the back of the top is everything that's where the surprise is you would have thought had you not seen the back that um the the front and the back are probably the same but clearly not it has this black um ribbon that she's tied bare in the back and let me tell you if you're one of those girls that can't go without a bra don't be afraid to wear a black bra wear a strapless black bra with a top like this do not make yourself uncomfortable to wear something make sure when you're wearing something that it is comfortable for you you will walk with confidence if you're comfortable and you look good if you have a big chest wear a nice strapless bra and wear this top you can even wear a different color of bra or you can wear a nude color and nude is the color that's closest to your skin tone nude does not mean beige nude does not mean chocolate nude means your complexion your skin color okay so wear something that is as close to your skin color as possible you can wear black you can wear white look if you want a pop of color you can even wear a different color um bra to you know bring life to the outfit anyway let's go to the third image we have two different outfits as you can see these outfits are summer outfits now a little bit of spring towards the end of spring into summer right i guess you can wear them now during spring because it's quite cold unless you're in florida like i said all you need for this you may have to wear a jacket in the mornings and in the evenings because it's still cold pants are cotton they're more on the casual side of things they are tailored like dress pants the top is sheer you can see from the pictures that there's a lot of sunshine there's a lot of natural light from the sun it's a beautiful day you can see the sun on her face and i love her lipstick i love the simpleness of her hair i love her dior sato bag i love her sandals they're not too high this is comfortable but elegant and chic at the same time she didn't have to wear anything to make her uncomfortable if you're not comfortable wearing four inch heels don't wear four inch heels wait until you're comfortable to wear four inch heels especially if you're starting out with heels start slowly move up go higher and higher slowly never make yourself uncomfortable to look emphasis on look stylish you actually look the opposite of what you think okay then this second outfit i love it looks like two slip dresses brown and white i think it's one dress made to look like two they fall the same way in the back and the front now if you have exactly the same dresses right i think you can layer them and just make one shorter than the other which whichever one you want on top you know we play with styles style is about being creative stylish people are creative people style is an art all right always remember that i love also her simple black and white sandals jewelry very simple only silver earrings left her neck uh, open and you see how the back is once again had i not showed you the different angle of this outfit i mean you would have to guess how this looked like i like the back more than the front of the dress and then she has this silver bangle she looks great simple a simple white bag shades 
silver jewelry, but somehow it looks like she did too much when she really did not. Our fourth image, so we have two outfits here, obviously the red dress and the black and white outfit. Let's start with the red dress elegant regal sophisticated timeless you could have found this dress in the 70s and you can buy this dress 20 years from today this is what i'm saying when i talk about timeless pieces her shoe this is a shoe somebody would have worn in the 20s 30s 40s 50s 60 70 80 90s 2000 and today 2024 and even in 2050 they're going to wear this shoe. Timeless pieces, simple jewelry, earrings. The dress is speaking for itself. The shoes are speaking for themselves. The hair is just slicked back, brushed back, simple. This is elegant. You can even tie it back, you know? I love that it has these long neck I guess I'm going to call them neckties. She can tie them in front. She can wrap them around, tie them in the back. She can tie them on either shoulder on the side. She can actually tie it around her waist and make a ribbon. I mean, this is playful. Instead of doing that, she just allowed them to just hang there and flow in the wind as she walked, as you can see here. So again, timeless piece. This is not a uh, two year. This is not from 2023. This is, I think, two or three years old, this image. Timeless. Spring, summer, right? Work, office, dinner, weddings, meetings. It works all around. This black and white outfit, we can see why it's very springing. It, she has pants and a dress over her pants for that warmth if she needs it. And if it's in summer, it gets warm, take off your pants. You're good to go, right? Again, she doesn't have too much jewelry, just a tiny denty necklace. Let's go to our very last outfit. Guys, don't forget if you like anything in this video, don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Once again, style inspiration 101. We learn from others, taking inspiration from others. We are not copying from from others but if you so happen to have these pieces but you just didn't know that you can put them together like this go ahead do your thing i mean who's gonna know nobody's gonna know okay these three outfits just scream honestly i'm every woman okay i can be regal and royal and i can be casual and gangster mm -hmm. I'm every woman when it comes to fashion. I would wear everything I showed you in this video, including what you're looking at right now. And to me, I love this. These women, these three, very different women, but somehow you can see that they can all wear what the other is wearing. This first girl right here, I can so see her wearing this and this. And same, I can see this girl wearing this and this and i can see this last girl wearing this and this they have similar style aesthetic to me right and there's something so beautiful about how they look even how they are standing they don't care they're just cool they are confident they have they don't follow trends they set the trends right? The trends that you're seeing on TikTok, these images were there before you even knew what TikTok was. Okay. It's so individual to them. And this is what you should always strive for, especially when you're trying to express yourself through your clothes or outfits. Let you come through the clothes. Let me know who you are before you even speak. We judge you in, in, a, in a few seconds, we judge you. So don't give me something you're not. Okay? Be careful how you dress. Because it says a lot about who people think you are. Maybe that's not who you are. Because you are busy copying how somebody else dresses. And we have misunderstood you based on how you express yourself before you even speak. And you always wonder, why do people treat me like this? Those people who actually get to know you, they're surprised at who you are based on what they saw. They're like, 
oh my God, I just thought you were somebody else. Have you ever had somebody think you were someone you were not? Ask yourself, why did they think that before they even met you or even spoke one word to you? Forget what they heard from someone else. Something to think about. Anyway, I love these three outfits. They speak for themselves. They are cool. They're individuals. Anyway, guys, that's the end of this video. Let me know what you think. Don't forget to like, share, subscribe. Until the next style class, one Oh, one. Bye.